Hello! I bought a new gun, the Artemis RP900W, uh, the 5.5 that's fed by pre-charged pneumatic air, 0.22 caliber, 5.5 millimeter. So let's do a small unboxing. Well, the manual was in there. Anyway, here it is. It's actually pretty light. It's, uh, what was it? 2194 grams basic uh, configuration. And uh, the store I bought it at didn't have the, uh, the pump I wanted. So they, they actually, if we could focus on the manometer, they actually pumped it up to 15 bars. Uh, I don't actually know what that's in PSI, like 1500 PSI, so I could take a few shots. Okay. And I bought one of these, uh, that's the one I pressed to focus. The, uh, it's a sample one. So there, we got, and this fucking thing can't focus. But anyway, we got uh, 30 uh, 5.51 millimeter. We got uh, the, we got it in grams and grains, and the heaviest bullet here is 25 grains. And it's 52.2 millimeters, 1.645 grams. I'm gonna guess it's this one. And we can't focus. Anyway, I don't have a proper scope yet, so uh, there won't be much searing since I also can only shoot like 20 shots or something. Uh, I got these extra bits for it. This is the magazine. It takes seven shots. It comes with. Let's see if we can do this. Let's see if we can do this without cooking it. Anyway, it comes with a, a single loader there, uh, default loaded. Uh, I don't want to cook it now because it's full of uh, gas. Um, I'll save that for later. Anyway. A bunch of spare o-rings and uh, a charging adapter. Switching mics here. So I uh, I start my morning by uh, trying to fire up my uh, moped because the, the weather was such a nice day and it's one of the last days it was uh, 10 degrees uh, C uh, or degrees science or 50 degrees Fahrenheit I believe that translates to. So I de decided to take the moped and the, uh, well, the car, I guess you, you say, uh, and go to uh, the store. And um, it, my moped didn't start at all, so I put down like a heater on the engine block and I changed spark plugs and everything. And finally I got it working after heating it up. So uh, here, here's some pictures on, on my way home. These are just for babes on Snapchat to impress them. So here, here's some pictures from the, inside the store. The, 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 the top one there on the right is uh, another Artemis that I've been uh, having my eye on for a while. The other ones here are Hatsan. Maybe you can read the words. Um, some of these scopes are interesting. Uh, and... Uh, yeah, I, I, I guess I'll leave the uh, store link in the description below. Anyway, they also have like World War II replicas and I guess Vietnam War replicas. And I get that, I guess that flint look is like a 1600s. But all these pistols, they use that steel ball ammo. That's uh, 4.42 millimeter, I believe. And uh, First of all, I don't want to shoot ball ammo. Secondly, I don't want to shoot steel ammo. So I'm, lo I'm looking for a pistol that's like semi-auto that shoots the regular pellets. 
I don't know if there is a gun like that, but that that's what I want on my holster when I do a two gun match with a well with my Sig Sauer. Uh, I'll, I'll I'll get to that when that's working. Um, they got a little pistol selection over here. Um, they they got some um, HKs. I believe these were copies of. I don't remember the brand. Maybe you can read it. Uh, and uh, they got quite a selection of uh, bullets. Pellets, I mean pellets. They even have these uh, Russian ones with uh, like firecracker primers in them. Well, um, that's it. See you later, guys. Uh, let's, uh, let's stop this thing. Uh, bye.